Hey, what's up, everybody? It's the Real Rasta Boy TV, and it's your boy, the Real Rasta Boy, coming to you on <clears throat> Sunday night. Yes, ma'am. <clears throat> it's a bit. It's a bit. Um, <clears throat> I'm trying to fix this damn camera. Can y'all see me? Oh, yes, ma'am. Giving y'all a little nasty ass long hair on shoulder stuff tonight. Oh my God, Black Girl Rocks BET tonight was amazing. Just gonna give you a quick recap of Black Girls Rock tonight. First, let us. I'm sorry. First, um, my girl Jan um, Janelle Monet. She opened up the show. Um, you know, with our step crew, and she did the damn thing. You know, Janelle Monet. You know, Miss Electrify Lady. And before we go into damn further, I want to give a big cheers up to Miss Janelle Monet and everybody at the Black Girls Rock from um, Regina King and um. Um, and Tracy Ellis Ross, the entire BET staff, for, and everybody who's involved with the Black Girl Rock movement. Y'all rock tonight, so I'm giving a big cheers up to y'all because that was an amazing show tonight on BET. You know, BET sometimes get a lot of black backlash for some of the shows that they do, like award show, because it's not really produced or done properly. But tonight was amazing. The performers, the awardees, the um, the presenters, everything was awesome. So I give y'all a big cheers up. And what I'm drinking on tonight... Something simple is tropical fruit juice, vodka, and 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 some and some um peach snaps. You know I love me some peach snaps. So see, very simple apple um um peach snaps, tropical fruit juice, and vodka. Mm. So cheers to y'all, black girl who rocks. So Janet Monet she opened the show. Miss Electrified Lady she did the damn thing after she opened the show. I'm saying all like Tracy Ellis Ross and Regina did both look good as the host. You know, they were rocking it out from the changing off clothes to the duo, um, you know, corny jokes or whatever. They, they did a damn thing. Um, Venus Williams was the first reci recipient of one of the Black Girl Rocks um, trophies. Um, you know, I didn't care too much for her outfit, but I love seeing her back in um, rocking braids. You know, we love and used to Serena and Venus. Um, I think it was Venus who got the award. One of them. Ven I can't tell my part sometimes. I think Venus got the award. Anyway, um, we're used to um, Serena and Venus Williams always rocking their braids when, when they start out with their beads and stuff and their natural hair. Um, after that um, performance, um, so after, after that, um, we saw the amazing Jennifer Hudson. And girl, hands down, hands down, even I didn't know the song that you were performing, it seemed like it was new. You rock bitch, you are wearing this damn black leather suck on um, pants and this nice little sweater shirt like looking like you're giving a little throwback to the 80s. Your short pixie hairdo was everything and bitch you are working it and you're working it. I'm like go ahead Jen. And Jennifer is working it. I'm like Jennifer Hudson. You are did a you did you're not you not even did a 180. You did a whole DM 360 from the time that we saw you from American Idol to now being a, a wife. No, I mean, a, she's not wife yet. A mother and still being a superstar from you know acting and singing. Jennifer Hudson, you are did a DM 360 and you do the damn thing because you look good and you still sound good. So to all haters out there who say that Jennifer Hudson and her Weight Watchers, eat it, bitch. So. After J. Hell came out and did her thing, they gave another award to this lady named, um, I think, Miriam or Marianne. Um, she was given an award. You know, she was one of the, um, I think, first black um, person to graduate from some kind of school inducted in some kind of, um, what was it again, um, law or something, the bar. You know, it's very hard for us black people sometimes to break you know break um doors down and and set you know standards and boundaries and all that stuff and this lady you know was one of the first person inducted in the um to the bar and all that was so everybody in the show was you know special in my opinion because everybody who's doing something worthwhile and needs to be awarded and 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 and, and, and recognized so i really commend um the Black Girls Rock Movement for giving an award. Then Miss Lettucey came out in this nasty ass onesie, one, um, I don't know what to describe it. She was giving me all suck on outfit with this nasty ass, you know, she has dressed like me. She was, she, she curled them and had them big old, um, what call it, like Lion King, not even Lion King, that, yeah, Lion King, big curly hair, and that, no lie, she sound good, man, that onesie on her, 
cat suit, um, body suit that shows rocking that. Kind of look good because, you know, when girls rock body suits, I mean, you need to make sure your body is snatched, no stomach, your tummy is flat. And she was doing a little dancing and stuff. She did a whole cheer thing and, you know, trying to work it out. I'm like, go ahead, let her see. Don't let, don't let the girls, these young girls, I'm um, trying to um, show you up. You need to show out and show up. And so she did. So go ahead, let us see for also um, rocking it out. Um, the, I like seeing also that the girlfriends, you know, the girlfriends from the, the show that we used to watch on CW um, and what I think it was called double B that time, whatever it was called. Now it's called something else. And they have a, a lot of reruns now on BET. The creative director of the, um, the show, the girlfriends, they reunited tonight with Tracy Elias Ross from, um, what's the name? What? I can't remember their name, all the name, but all of them, the girl with the dreads. Um, so all the two black girls on with the big lips, all of them are there tonight giving, um, a special award to the, the creator and writer of Girlfriends, and she's also the writer of The Game, that's coming back on BET soon, and she also is doing Mary Jane, so she's doing the damn thing for a black woman who rocks, so she also was awarded tonight also, some, I, I love, I would love to get, um, a, a, um, a, a Girlfriends movie or, um, a damn reunion or something, can y'all work on that BET? Um, Amber Riley also came out and did her thing. You know, Amber Riley, you know, she's dancing with the stars right now, and she, um, she's also um, Glee. She, you know, she, we know she can sing because you know most people on Glee, the show got, that comes on Fox, we know that everybody on Glee can sing, or should be able to sing. But she rocked it out. She looked really nice. She was giving me curly, curly um, Kelly roll on here, um, and she was looking good. What with her outfit, you know, some some of these full figure girls sometimes don't look really cute. Because you know they don't they don't dress appropriate sometimes for their body type. But Amber Riley, you're looking good tonight, and I love the hair. Also, um, hands down, Kelly Rowland came out and showed out tonight. Kelly Rowland, you showed out tonight from the intro of your song "Gone." Don't know what you got till it's gone. Da -da 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 -da. And you don't know what you got till it's gone. Gave you my heart and stick to my. No. Mm. This is on her new album, so if y'all have not heard it yet, go ahead and cop Miss Kelly Roll a new single, Gone. It's now out on iTunes and every damn where. She brought Seven Streeter out, and Seven Streeter was looking cute with her little cute self. And I'm like, look up a balcony, and there goes Evie, rapper Evie, tore it down. And she and Eve. Eve Seven Streeter, Kelly Rowland, you did a damn thing. That was one of my highlights of the night for Black Girl Rocks. I'm like, Kelly Rowland, you need to do more promotion for this album because I'm telling you, like, this album that you did recently was a good album. Again, there goes the Dark Car Labels again, not giving y'all enough shine, but there goes you again. Want to go be a judge, judge and extra instead of trying to promote your damn album and giving us no um, videos and um, appearances and stuff. You're doing too many X Factor now. I'm, I'm going to be another album that's going to be kind of. Oh, she did the album. Oh, really? We can't remember the, the last single that was on the album. But anyway, Kiki Palmer was also one of the presenters. She looked really cute. You know, she's always looking cute and fabulous. You know, she also was in a recent TLC movie and then she did her damn thing. So big shout out to her too. Um, who else? I'm, I'm trying to see who else um performed that I liked. Um, oh Lord, Miss Patti LaBelle. Did I, do I need to say more? She showed up. Miss Patti LaBelle, legendary Miss Patti LaBelle. She came down looking gorge. Gorge, like her fucking face was freezed. Like she never, she never aged since the last time she did a, you know, we know Miss Patti LaBelle have done a little facelift here and there. She's, you know, got a little nip and tuck somewhere and she's making no secrets. Got her nose fixed, all that stuff. She looks phenomenal. Miss Patti LaBelle, you look and sound great tonight. And I saw you dipping it low and picking it up slow while you were doing your little performance. But go ahead, Miss Patti, and show them what it is for a lady over 60 that rocks. Okay, so after that, um, Miss Patti LaBelle in her awesome performance, we saw, um, who was this? Queen Latifah, the queen, the queen from her business ventures from Cover Girl to, um, to, 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 um, to clothing line, to the perfumes that she has, to now the new syndicated talk show that she has on, um, I think ABC or CBS, one of those stations, the Queen Latifah show. Oh my God. 
big shout out to you, Queen. You deserve it. You know, you've been doing your thing from back in the days when you did, you know, um, hip hop to now, you know, being actress, to now being a businesswoman, to now being a talk show host. You're just an all over around black girl who rocks. Too. So big up to Queen Latifah. You also got your award for rock star. Um, and, um, and can we say that Mariah Carey showed up and showed out when she gave her, um, her godmother, Miss Patti LaBelle, also um, a, um, an award. Because we know that um, Miss Mariah Carey don't show up at many events unless she's performing. But she showed up tonight and she was wearing this scandalous skimpy outfit, having her tummy out after giving birth to twins, you know, a couple years ago. Girls, you know, girls still showing that bitch she got it. So big shout out to Mariah Carey, you look cute. She was giving me the center part with very loose curls. Um, a lot of cl um, cl cl clutterage, you know, a lot of boob booby cleavage, and the tummy was all out. It's not super flat like Sierra is flat or like Kelly Rowland and flat, flat stomach, but it was flat enough so that like, I can go there and rub my hand across it and not feel any lumps. Because she knows she want to be on TV, so she want to show up her body and show us. So, um, my girl Mariah Carey, I can't wait to hear the new album. I know it's going to be coming out before the end of the year. But you gave your godmother Miss Ari Miss your godmother Miss Patti LaBelle her tribute tonight, you know, her award for um, you know, a black girl who also rocked from doing stuff from LaBelle's to, you know, um to solar artists to cookbooks and all that stuff. Patti LaBelle has been around for over fifty years and she's still looking gorge. Um but in a way, overall the black girl rock Tonight on BET, big shout out to everybody over there who's a part of the production staff and a part of the committee, you know, pr pr production, everybody, tens, tens, tens across the damn board for everybody at Black Girl Rocks, amazing show, I loved it, thank you again for another awesome, awesome, awesome show overall, and my two highlights of the nights was Patsy Level, of course, and Kelly Rowland with 7th Street and Eve, everybody else also did a good job, but I'm telling you no lie. This was one of the cute little show tonight, and big and big up to everybody who was also that I did not call their names, who also was inducted in the Black Girls Rock recipient of Hall of Fame. What do y'all want to call it? But the show was awesome. My that was my highlights of the show. Thank you all so much for watching. Please keep on subscribing and two thumbs up the videos. Please share it on your Facebook, your Twitter, your Instagram, wherever you share your videos at Forty by Text. But thank y'all for watching and make sure y'all leave y'all comments about what was your favorite moment or moments tonight on Black Girl Rock BET special um, presentation show tonight. Anyway, I enjoy myself, but I gotta go because there's more shit on TV to watch. And please subscribe because I'm gonna give y'all more shit to watch. Okay, from the rest of boy TV is the rest of boy on Twitter, Instagram, and Facebook all at the same time. From then, bop. I said bop, bop.